What up, Melvin7 here, and today I'm bringing you my third player review. It's going to be Henrik Mikatarin, the 85 rated right winger who transferred to Manchester United in the summer. 83 pace, 87 dribbling, 77 shooting, 81 passing and 70 physical with 5 star weak foot and 4 star skill moves. He's also got high high work rates so I will see how that affects in game. But in terms of his in game stats, the best ones being probably agility, uh, being 88, 84 acceleration, 83 balance, 82 sprint speed for his physical attributes. Uh, the skill attributes he's got very high across the board to be fair 89 ball control 86 dribbling 85 short passing and 87 shot power being his uh, best ones and he's also got the specialities dribbler acrobat and the traits long shot taker and corner specialist as you may have seen in the intro i did play five games with mikatarian i believe he got two goals and three assists or so three goals and two assists and i also used the hunter chemistry style that is the chemistry style i think works best for Mikatarian purely because he gets that extra pace and that extra shooting which I think he drastically needs you could use other things like the engine or the maestro but for me shelling out that little bit more just to increase the pace and shooting stats is well worth the difference as you can see scoring some uh, some nice goals but overall he's such an enjoyable player to use I mean you might think I'm being a bit biased uh, you know Manchester United and all that but Especially with the Hunter chemistry style, it negates his pace being a little low for a winger and his shooting, certainly. But his passing was amazing, his crossing, fantastic. Dribbling was just sublime. As soon as he got the ball, his first touch was impeccable and then that, able, that enabled him to create some amazing attacks. Now, unfortunately, I didn't get to use him as much as I would have liked, although I played five games. These were also the five games that I used to review Martial as well. So some of the highlights are the same because both the players work together. But of course, Mkhitaryan had some individual highlights as well. But I would have liked to use him a bit more. But overall, he just seems like such an all-rounded, uh, well-rounded player. Like on the wing, he, he surprises me. He, he really surprises me how good of a winger he is. He probably would have been better as a cam. But overall, so many positives. I didn't even talk about his weak foot which is of course five stars so it's absolutely terrific four star skills as well i love that in a winger uh, agility and his ball control his, his first touch was impeccable and the way he managed to keep hold of the ball when he had it was brilliant crossing i've already been through as well as passing his vision that just comes in in, in hand in hand with passing and crossing dribbling and also stamina which is very high the only cons i can come up with or are strength sometimes he, he does lack a bit, so he'll he'll lose the ball after controlling it very, very well, but that, that's very occasional. Finishing, that's why I recommend the Hunter chemistry style, because sometimes it'll be a bit mismatched. I used him for two games without the Hunter chemistry style before putting it on, and I definitely noticed a difference. And pace, a bit similar with the finishing. That's why I recommend the Hunter chemistry style. So overall, I'll give Mkhitaryan a 9 out of 10 rating. I really enjoyed him. Some of the things he did... On, on the ball and even off like making the runs were just terrific value for money I'd also say 9 because at the minute I think he's like 36k which for an 85 rated newly transferred uh, card I think that's fantastic and he'll, he'll probably rise a little bit before dropping but he's worth every coin in my opinion so hopefully you have enjoyed subscribe if you haven't already like the video and yeah peace